I've got a quick date. Oh, blah, blah, blah. These are the ABCs of me, baby. Teeny, teeny cornhole boards. I can't even remember what I was talking about. A quick update. Teeny, weeny, tiny. Update for you with a brand. <laughs> yada, 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 with a brand. It was an itsy bitsy, teeny, weeny, tiny cornhole board, believe me. Hey guys, Ricky here with Apple Valley Farm. I got a quick update for you on our cornhole boards, or actually on our tiny cornhole boards. These guys right here, we started making these a couple of weeks ago and we cannot make these suckers fast enough. So, I mean, I'm really excited, but I've been getting a lot of questions about them. And one of the things is about the, uh, about the bags that go with them. And I know we call them tiny cornhole boards, but actually they're, they're more intended to be used with quarters. And there's a whole set of rules, yada, 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 but they're intended to be used with quarters. Now, there are people who make the little bitty tiny cornhole bags that you can use with these and we can get them for you, but we don't do that as a normal thing. Anyway, having said that, if you need the bags, we can get them, just let me know, we'll kind of work it all out. I wanna show you a couple of shots about how this works with the quarters so you will know, and then when you get one of these, you'll know how to play it. All right, here we go. Okay, so I'm gonna start out showing you the, the technique here. So, and I'm no expert at this, but I'm holding the coin like this. I'm holding it flat so I can throw it down on the playing surface in front of the cornhole board or the quarter toss board, whatever you want to call it. And it theoretically will bounce up and boop and go right in the hole. If you throw this thing flat down, it it will just, it'll drop like a rock and it'll just sit there. But what I have learned is that you have to get some momentum going. So you don't want to throw it down and actually just just kind of bounce it like a ball. You want to get some momentum going and then you want to throw it from back here. So like this, see like that. So otherwise you're going to do this. And it's going to do nothing. See, and I'm getting better all the time, but I, I'm still like, I'm still like the world's worst. All right, so if there was any doubt, now the whole world knows that I am the worst tiny cornhole board player in the, in the world. Ah, it looks deceptively simple, but, but there's actually a little bit of technique to it. So anyway, you just have to kind of fiddle around with it and you'll get better. And who knows, next thing you know, we'll be on ESPN with these things. So hey, thanks a lot for hanging out. If you guys need us to make you any tiny cornhole boards, we can do them like we do the burned ones like this. Uh, we could just paint them. We can put some logos on them. We can really, I mean, we can do just about anything you want. These or full-size cornhole boards, let us know. Look us up at applevalleyfarmga.com. Give us an email at info at applevalleyfarmga.com. Thank you so much. Have a great day. Go make something. Have fun. See ya. Hey, as always, guys, thank you so much for hanging out with us and supporting the work we do here at Apple Valley Farm and OT2 Games. Hey, to watch our latest video, please click right up here. And to subscribe to our YouTube channel, which will absolutely change your life, be sure to click down here. Thank you. Have a great day. Go have fun.